Okay. We, can, we can all agree. Blackface equal woman's face. Drag queens. Agree that this is terrible because it makes a mockery of a group of people by creating a caricature of them. A yeah, so. Okay. You know. Yes, that's bad. Oh, dude. I can't with this blackface thing. It's so weird. All right. Yeah. Obviously, blackface is bad. And the reason blackface is bad is because historically, in America, blackface has been used to mock black people and make fun of them and to also have white actors in movies take the place of black people. It's a mockery and it always has been. And it's been a way to exclude black people from specific spaces. That is an objective truth that's in America. Okay. The history of drag is not that. <clears throat> okay. The history of drag is not that whatsoever. Okay. There. A group which also happens to be one of the ones that the left wants to shield from anything that could possibly offend them, or as they would ridiculously phrase it, microaggressions. So then why is the left, the group that's usually outraged by just about everything, not just as upset about this? Which we should all be able to agree is terrible and offensive because it's making a mockery of a group of people by creating a caricature of them. And this group also... But that's the thing is it's not a mockery created to make a character of people. So for the most part, drag in America at least, I like if you go way far back, like not even in America, when they didn't want women to like perform like in Greece and stuff, like yeah, they'd use men. But that's not the history of actual drag. Realistically speaking, bro, gay, it's usually gay men like to dress up like women, usually musicians that they really uh, respected and liked a lot. And then they would like sing and dance like the musician. Or lip sync. That's it. There was no, there was no disrespect behind it. It was like an actual, like it, they were being respectful as fuck. Okay. Um. So yeah, that's it. It's really not that deep. It's a bunch of gay guys that want to dress like girls. That's it. It's it's a totally different. It's a much more respectable exper experience. There was no like deep seated fucking female oppression based off of it. It's crazy. I, it's just an, it's an, it's a, the argument is out of control. Also happens to be another one of the ones in which the left wants to shield from anything which could possibly offend them, or as they would ridiculously phrase it, microaggressions. So why is it that the left isn't offended by this? Is it because it's not offensive? It's not. It's just because it's not offensive. That's why nobody nobody fucking cares. Because this is the same group that can't even define what a woman is, or because the left is the same group that thinks that men and women are interchangeable with nothing special separating. Can we just talk about how the overwhelming majority of like the most bizarre transphobic people are fucking like almost gay? Like honestly, like fucking dude, look at <clears throat> bro. Honestly, you take a look like Ben Shapiro, Matt Walsh, even Steven Crowder, who's from what I've seen, admittedly like curious about men. They're all a little bit gay. I feel like they're all like a, like almost like they're overcompensating, dude. It's fucking. It's kind of weird. Like, holy shit. Like, you're, like, gas... You're trying to, like, go through, like, these mental gymnastics trying to make it seem like drag is the same thing as fucking blackface. It's just not. Them. Because keep in mind, not only are the left okay with this, they want to put it in front of kids with Drag Queen Story Hour. Most people don't. Most people are uncomfortable with that. Most people would allow the, 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 the parents to make that decision. I don't think that you should have your kid... Listen, realistically speaking, I don't think that you should have your little boy go to a drag show because I wouldn't. I wouldn't want my little boy to turn out fucking. I wouldn't want my little boy to, to look up to a drag person and become a, like want to do drag, whether they're straight or not. I just don't want my kid doing that. Now that might just be me being discriminating or some whatever, but the way I feel about shit isn't the way that everybody has to raise their kid. So I'm not going to legislate the lack of ability, or I wouldn't legislate uh, your ability to take your kid to a drag show away. Like, I don't care. Like, you know what I mean? I'm just not going to let my kid go to a drag show. Like, I don't know what you want me to tell you until they're, like, older. Maybe when they're in their, like, 14, maybe. Once they're th a bit through more, they're maybe, like, 16. I don't really know. <clears throat> That's it. It's really not that deep, bro. These people are fucking deranged. Honestly, thank you so much for watching, guys. And another special shout out to all my Patreon and Twitch subs. If you'd like to support this 